Welcome in my friends, Lazy Retired Granny here. It's Monday, August 28, 2023. The time is 5.50 a.m. here in Salem, Oregon. From what they say, it's supposed to be cooler today. Mid-80s. I am drinking my coffee with hazelnut creamer. I am working on my monthly mystery painting, which this is number 9 of 12 from the 12 pack that I purchased from Amazon last year. And I do one a month. And I have no idea. This reminds me of... Um, in the Harry Potter movie where um, oh, it was one of their classes and they had this thing and Harry Potter was going up to it. That's what it reminds me of. Anyway, but it's not. I don't know where. Somebody probably knows what this is, but I don't. Because this looks more like a, a girl here in a gown with this animal. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Okay. Um, so yesterday I did a video, uploaded it, and then went over to watch Mike's latest video on the head, or uh, Hedwig, um, Wilbur the pig just started watching when the internet went down yep went down again this time i guess there was issues um at their i don't know what you call it but anyway had nothing to do with us the whole thing went down oh boy so and when that goes down, I have no phone, no nothing, no TV, no computer. So, oh, the tower. It was at the tower that went down. And, yeah, so it finally... They restored it. It was probably around 9 o'clock last night. And by then it was <clears throat> really too late to do anything. So my son next door and I, we sat outside <laughs> and chatted again. <laughs> what to do when the internet goes down? You sit outside and chat. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with their equipment, but so I was trying to think what my plans are for the end of till the end of the year with my diamond painting and Oh boy, I got more to do than I thought I did. So, hopefully I finish this by the by Thursday. Because then it's time to kit up on Friday. For the black and white adventure journey. <laughs> And then my plan is, is, when I finish that, then I have to do my September mystery.
painting, monthly painting. And then hopefully I will have time to do at least one Harry Potter because um, Mike from Diamond Paintings with Mike He is doing Harry Potter diamond paintings in September. So I would like to do at least one with him. And I think I still have three diamond paintings to do three or four I can't remember um, I say I know I have the big partial and then I've got the glow in the dark which is a 30 by 40 and then I have another partial. Yeah, so one, two, three. But I don't think I can finish all of those in September. So I have to hold some of them over. And then I still have one, two, three paintings on my dedication to Mike that needs to be completed. And and I also have some stickers that I need to complete. And I want to do the um, Multnomah Falls that I got from Becky as a birthday present. And then I also have the Starry Nights that I got as a birthday present from Tita that I wanted to get done. And then, <clears throat> hold on, because I might have to put my readers on for this part. The S's and the B's are causing me a little bit of issues on this one. So let me look. Let's see. It looks like all the S is up there. Oh, now I got the hiccups. Yeah, and then I have one other diamond painting that I started. And need to finish it. Uh, let's see, what else do I have up there? gifted my daughter-in-law a diamond painting a couple of years ago. It's just a small one. And she's never done it. And she said, you know, 
Diamond painting is just not my thing. And she says, why don't you do it and then give it to me? <laughs> so I got to do that. So I think that might take me to the end of the year. And then I know that Becky Sloan and H, um, Diamond, um, DP Crazy Lady, we all have another diamond painting we all have so I need to get with them and see when they want to do that so we can schedule that for next year and it's a diamond art club so Becky t um, tell me which one you have Or what ones you have from Diamond Art Club. We can get that one on the books. For next year. If you like. And then that's as far as I've thought <laughs> I don't want to plan too far ahead because plans always change. And I am not doing any more large ones for the end of the year. Those are for next year. Start afresh, but I do want to tie up loose ends of what some of what I wanted to do for 2023 and then I've got my tiny fun 12 pack that I'm going to be doing one a month again this year I think some others are going to be doing that. I know um, Becky and DP Crazy Lady are. I think V is too. I know she got a 10 pack, but she wasn't real happy with that 10 pack. But you know, if you want to do the I don't know, I call them mystery packs, but the 12 pack you do once a month. I don't know what to call it um, because this year or next year, it's not a mystery pack. Mine's a tiny fun pack. Um, yeah, it's an idea if you want to do that also yeah I think that's the last of my 12 packs and you know actually with these little uh, paintings um, you know like the single ones that I have, I could make a 12 pack out of them and do those for 2025. Yeah, the little paintings are nice for those kinds of projects. I'm looking for the ease. Okay, I might have gotten them all. If not, I'll just come back later and get them. So, 
Yeah, I think we all have those paintings that we want to finish up. I think by the end of the year, I need to get out my... this off a little bit. Uh, why can't I find it? I have a a um, a bag of baby wipes. I'll just get out a different tray. Here to wash later. Kind of gluey, I think, or waxy. My my um drills are sticking to the tray. All right, back to this. What was I doing? Yeah, this canvas, I am going through lots of wax. Now I forgot what I was doing. M's. <coughs> so, let's see, what else... No, uh, nothing exciting last night since um, the internet was down. I did what this morning. I watched Crafting with B. She put up a video of, I think it was Diamond Art Club, an owl. Oh my gosh. I love that painting. It is beautiful. Reminds me of Hedwig. The white owl. Lot, she said there's lots of blues in it. And then some greens for the trees in the background. And it's got some ABs. It is absolutely stunning, but she might do that for the October Halloween theme. I think she said she's got one other that she's maybe thinking about, but that owl is big. It's a pretty big painting. But it is, oh my gosh, yeah. It reminds me of another one that I did see, and I think it was on um, Craftably's site. And then I watched Deepy Crazy Lady, and she showed um, a couple um, Diamond Art Club. It's in her stash. And one of them is Partners in Crime. That is adorable. Oh my gosh. That is so cute. So, yeah, I look forward to seeing her get the drills down on that one. And I look forward to crafting with B, getting the drills down on the owl. That's going to be stunning. Both of those are, I'm looking forward to seeing their progress.
So do you have any end of the year projects for diamond painting that you want to finish up? I think for me, my plans, I've it's going to take me, <coughs> excuse me, till the end of the year to get all those projects done. So, and then once I know what everybody wants to do for diamond dolls and I can't remember what canvases everybody has that we have that we all have that we like to do together it's just kind of fun to do the same canvas together and even though one person may I mean somebody always has to finish first but then you're doing the same canvas and you're getting their views on the canvas and then you know the next person you know you're seeing theirs everybody usually starts at a different place and um finish at different times and it's kind of i i know i enjoyed it with um the um chuck penson one Because you got to see it finished. And then I got to see mine. And then Becky, you know, she was um, continuing on with hers. And just some of her observations that she was noticing. I didn't notice in mine. Or it's like, oh, why didn't I think of that? Or, you know. <laughs> So I enjoy those. I love doing the same paintings as everybody, you know, as others. That's everybody, but it's kind of fun. Plus, you know, you have things to talk about with your friends and, um, that looks like a really small drill. I don't know. Let me get it in there. Yeah, I think that's a different shape. Not quite as big. I have one of those little green boats here. That's what I put my garbage in. So yeah, that's what I like. Um, I've just thoroughly enjoyed doing things with, there's a bee right there, I think. But that's okay. Yeah, the S and the B in this are Exactly the same color on the canvas and it's like one is a black and the other one is a really really dark brown boy my throat is really dry this morning I do have the door open to try to get some fresh air in here but it's nice and cool but I think maybe the pollen is 
going to cause issues today or whatever it is maybe not pollen but um you know those things that make your sinuses go cuckoo and if mine aren't ellie's are too so she's probably gonna have to have a peanut butter cocktail today My stew turned out so good. And of course, I make a pretty big thing of stew. I put it in the slow cooker. And so, um, then I put the leftovers and I put them in containers. And then I don't have to cook for a few days. And I can eat stew every day. Oh, I love stew. So, I've got enough stew, probably until Wednesday or Thursday. <laughs> so, I don't have to cook. Just warm it up and eat. Feed my face. So, then I think my next project for food is going to be spaghetti and spaghetti is a little bit more difficult I mean not difficult but um, I only make enough for a couple days so I'll have spaghetti for two days Yeah, I don't have anything on the agenda today other than I need to vacuum. I didn't vacuum yesterday. Ugh. And I need to get that done today. Usually I vacuum every day, but for some reason I didn't get that done. I was being lazy as usual. And, yeah, so other than that, that's the only project I have. And I'll have to see what is on Acorn TV, because their new shows come out on Monday mornings. So I'll check that out. I know, I live an exciting life over here. Oh, and I was watching The Wizard of Oz when I had it on pause because I was watching Mike, but as soon as his video was over, I was going to continue with The Wizard of Oz because I finished Gone with the Wind and no internet. So I got to finish watching that movie today. And then I got to see what other. I noticed that Casablanca was on there. I might watch that again because it does have Catherine Hepburn in it. She's my favorite. Not probably one of my favorites of hers, but um, but I don't know. Maybe my opinions will have changed when I because I haven't watched it for a long time.
Hopefully, <clears throat> I don't know what happened to Hoya Bella. She's not putting on very many videos. She said she was going to put up a, was it her? Oh, maybe not. Uh, so I don't know what's going on. She's just busy or doing other things than diamond painting. I know she has the black and white, but she hasn't said anything about it, so I don't know. She's back at work, so maybe she's busy with that. My goodness, I'm at 31 minutes already, and I've blabbered on about nothing. <sighs> Did I get all the L's? Some of these are kind of dark, so it's hard to see them. And if not, come back and get them later. I have big plans to get this done by Thursday, so we'll see if that happens or not. All right, I'm going to let you go. Thanks for stopping by, and we will chat with you later.